Good morning, everybody. I'm supposed to be a blessing. This is a reading for my Scorpios, Cancers, and Pisces. If you're new to my channel, please take a moment to like, subscribe, and comment. With that being said, you guys, let's get right on into your reading. I feel like there's a lot of decisions that need to be made in regard to you. And that's you in your own energy, um, in a thought process, trying to figure some things out. Some of you may be feeling kind of stuck. You're not moving forward or backwards in regard to the situation. Some of you may have some type of court case or something like that going on. You're needing some things to balance out within your life. You could be dealing with a Libra individual. But I also see you getting some wishes that are going to be fulfilled here. Anything that you could be hoping or wishing for could definitely come to fruition. But yet I feel like somebody's in their emotions and they're starting to lost something. Now this could be you or somebody you'd be dealing with um, feeling some type of way. Uh huh. I feel like there was some competition that could have come up against you, but I feel like you stood, you stood, your strength. You could have been dealing with a Leo, and I also see here, um, you're talking about one thing going to another. There's a financial increase on the horizon for you. You're gonna be able to celebrate in regard to this. Keep using your intuition because it will never lead you astray. Okay, as being a water sign, some of you definitely could be dealing with other water signs, but I feel like this is you looking at these heavy loads that you. have that you're toting. Some of you are carrying something heavy. And that's a ten of wands. You've been carrying it for a very long time. The good thing about it is you're going to be able to put that down and keep it moving. Even though you're still feeling very guarded in a sense. So somebody did something and it had you feeling kind of guarded. Hmm. I feel like you have a lot of offers that could be coming your way, but you have to use your intuition in regard to that. And be careful because somebody could be trying to betray you, trying to steal something from you. Um, just on that foul shit, you know what I'm saying? So keep your eyes open in regard to that. The phone card lets me know that you want a new beginning. You want to jump out and do something new and exciting. You're not afraid to do so. You're seeking stability in your life. You want that firm foundation. You can't build a house on a rocky foundation. And that's what you want. You want a firm foundation. You want, some of you want a fresh start. And, uh, yeah, moving to a new place or something like that. I also see here you've been defending yourself against a lot of people for a very long time. Mm. Feeling like you're trapped, like you can't get out of a situation because you feel like you've been stabbed in the back here. Wow, this is heavy. Somebody feels like somebody stabbed them in the back, but the good thing about that, that's, that's an ending card. There's still a lot of fuck file shit around you, though, so what's really going on? What's going on? Some of y'all need to cleanse yourself, cleanse your aura, cleanse your space. Um... Some of y'all definitely have some enemies around you. Some people who could be pretending like they're your friend when actuality they're not. I also see um, some of you got some family members who you think that they're really in your corner, but they're not either. They get behind your back and talk about you like a damn dog. I do see a lot of heartache and pain here, and I feel like some of you just want to walk away from this situation. And you, rightfully so, you need to leave some shit behind. I mean, if it ain't working out for you, it's time for you to move on from that situation because I do see where you could be in a place where you can um, manifest some things that you really want. Planting seeds for prosperity, growth and wealth. Doors of opportunity will open up for you but you kind of come out of this fucked up energy right about up in here. All this bullshit right here. You got to deal with this shit here. Whoever has betrayed you, you need to put a foot or so on their ass and keep it moving. Deal with the situation. Give it to the universe. Give it to your spirits. Let them deal with it because um, they see everything. Yeah, instead of you being there, standing there being stuck because somebody done stabbed you in the back, they done betrayed you. Okay, so they did that. What you going to do? Just lay there and not get up? You got to get up. I also see, even though they're still coming at you and they could still cause you some more heartache and pain, this somebody thought somebody never would do something like this to them, and they did, and then they walked away. That's what I'm seeing as well. That's another scenario with that. But you're going to have to hear from this situation. Keep it moving because there's... um prosperity waiting for you. I do see new love coming in for you. I see that you want to birth out some new exciting things. I see somebody could be definitely be birthing out a baby or birthing out a business. Um, when I say birthing out a baby, I'm not talking about a baby baby. I'm talking about birthing out a baby that's like in a business or something like that. Them bitches don't always have to be, oh, I'm birthing out somebody's pregnant. You could be pregnant with ideas that you need to um, bring it to fruition. Because your creativity is definitely high right about now. I see some of y'all sexual energy is high too. But look at that. There's a lot of growth that you have to go through. There's a lot of learning lessons that you have been through. But you still got a long way to go. Look at that. You have some blessings on the horizon that's coming in. I do see emotional fulfillment and happiness. And what I said, healing. 
that needs to be taking place. Okay, you guys? Healing that's going to balance some things out. And you're going to be feeling okay. Yeah. You done been through a rough patch. Okay, you guys. So with that being said, I'm going to end your reading right here. Please take a moment to like, subscribe, and comment. And have a truly, truly blessed day. If you like your own personal reading, you can always call me at 347-227-5723. Until next time, y'all have a truly blessed day. Thank you.